Good afternoon, everyone. Thank you for joining the prayers today. Good afternoon, everyone. Thank you for joining the prayers. I hope you're well. Thank you for joining. We're going to start by just worshiping while everyone here, I just want to type in the comment section, this is the time for the fulfillment of prophecy. This is the time for the fulfillment of prophecy. Share the link with your friends. I'm going to play um, a section of the spontaneous worship. You know, while we share the link with our friends, let them know that we're, about, we're praying already. We worship you, Jesus. Oh, we worship you, Jesus. We worship you, Jesus. We worship you, Jesus. Yahweh. 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 Alpha. Alpha. Hello him. Hello him. Hello him. El Shaddai. El Shaddai. Jirei, Jirei. Oh, Sata Pacumba Liga Barabas. Kaba Liga Barabapura Basanda. No longer shall people ask you where is your God. No longer shall people ask you where is your God. No longer shall people ask you where is your God. Kura Basata Kapa Liga Basanda. Oh, Rabba Santa Barada Santa. Oh, glory to God, glory to God, glory to God, glory to God. Once again, we're going to start by thanking Him, thanking Him, glory to God. Let's go ahead and thank Him. Let's thank you for the strength to wait upon him in fasting and prayer. Let's thank you for the strength to wait upon him in fasting and prayer. Let's thank you for the strength to wait upon him in fasting and prayer. Let's go ahead and bless his holy name today. Father, thank you. They begin to declare. The Bible says, everyone that appeared before the Lord shall... The Bible says, everyone that appeared in Zaron shall go from strength to strength. Go ahead and thank him. The Lord, I'm strengthening. My, I'm going from strength to strength. My strength is very new. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, my spiritual strength is very new. My physical strength is very new. The Bible says, everyone that appeared before the Lord in Zion, they shall go from strength to strength. Declare with me that my physical strength is renewed. My spiritual strength is... Go ahead and declare. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, so prakate lege re mashante kaya in o shatabaya in Jesus name we pray begin to declare with me two things we are declaring that Lord as I wait upon you my strength is being renewed in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ as I wait upon you my strength is being renewed my weight on you is not in vain declare it that my weight on God is not in vain praise the Lord my weight on God is not in vain my weight upon the Lord is not in vain. My strength is renewed from glory to glory. My weight upon the Lord is not in vain. My strength is being renewed in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. My strength is being renewed. Makora basante, makora basanta, makora basante, makora.
Raba Santa, Kuraba Shante, Raba Kunda, E Remuzuske de Brande Kapaya, La Kosha Payama Nan Kapaya. My strength is being renewed. Glory to God. My strength is being renewed. Glory to God. My strength is being renewed. Glory to God. Oh Raba Shanta. My weight on the Lord is not in vain. Glory to God. Oh Raba Sheke Tele Gorumo Sondo Loromakaya. E Risco Prakatama Nashante Kabarabara. E Lekopone Moshonto Loroba Kamanate Sazia. E Bronte Karabashinto Lorobo Koramasante. In Jesus' name we pray. In Jesus' name we pray. Type it in the comment section. My strength is being renewed. My weight on the Lord is not in vain. My strength is being renewed. My weight on the Lord is not in vain. Glory to God. There's a scripture we're using to pray today and we'll use it to pray next level tomorrow. And that scripture is from Ezekiel chapter 12. Ezekiel chapter 12. Ezekiel chapter 12. Ezekiel chapter 12. Glory to God. Ezekiel chapter 12. In verse 23. Ezekiel chapter 12 in verse 23. Ezekiel chapter 12 in verse 23. All glory to God. Hallelujah. See what the Bible says here. I'll read from verse 22. You can then be type in the comment section. Sorry, Ezekiel chapter 12, verse 2. Um, Ezekiel chapter 12 in verse 22. Son of man, what is the proverb that you have in Israel? Saying that, um, okay, I'm going to, uh, that's King James. I want to read the uh, message translation. I want to read the New Living Translation. The New Living Translation. The New Living Translation. Thank you, Jesus. Ezekiel chapter 12, verse 22. It's a very powerful scripture. Glory to God. Ezekiel chapter 12, verse 22. The Bible says this. This is what the Bible says. Son of man, you have heard that you have heard that proverb they quote in Israel. Time passes and prophecy comes to nothing. It says there's a proverb they normally say that time passes and prophecy comes to nothing. He said, but this is what they say. Tell the people, this is what the sovereign Lord says. I will put an end to this proverb. You will soon stop quoting it. Now give them this new proverb to replace the old one. What is a new proverb? The time has come for every prophecy to be fulfilled. Hallelujah. That's what we're going to declare in this segment of prayer. The Bible says this is a new proverb. That the time has come for every prophecy to be fulfilled. I want to type in the comment section. I want to declare it. The Bible says the time has come for every prophecy to be fulfilled. Ezekiel chapter 22 in verse 13. Thank you, Jesus. Father, we give you praise. Father, we give you praise because the time has come for every prophecy to be fulfilled. Lord, I give you praise and glory. Father, the time has come for every prophecy to be fulfilled. Lord, I give you the praise and the glory and the praise and the glory and the praise and the glory of God. The time has come for every prophecy to be fulfilled. Hallelujah. Every prophecy over my life, every prophecy over your life, over your health, over your ministry, over your work, over your family, over your marriage. The Bible says the time has come for every prophet to be fulfilled. There will no more be delay. The time has come, glory to God, for every prophet to be fulfilled. The time has come for every prophet to be fulfilled. Receive it in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Receive it in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. I prophesy over some today that the time has come for every prophecy to be fulfilled has so no matter how long you've been waiting no matter how difficult it has been in the name of jesus christ receive it right now i declare over you robashante kabaya you are stepping into the season where every prophecy will be fulfilled the prophecy over your job the prophecy over your health over your family over your marriage over your finances you are stepping into the season where every prophecy has been fulfilled according to Ezekiel chapter 12 verse 22 and 23 receive it in the name of the Lord Jesus oh shakabaya the seasons of delay are over the seasons of disappointment are over for someone under the sound of my voice in the name of Jesus Christ in Jesus name we pray 
In Jesus' name we pray. All glory to God. You've come to a time where every prophecy is fulfilled. You've come to a time where every prophecy is fulfilled. Oh, yeah, but declare it. Write it. Amen. Write in the comment section. I've come to a time where every prophecy is being fulfilled. In Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' mighty name. <clears throat> in Jesus' mighty name. Amen and amen. In Jesus' mighty name. Glory to God. Glory, 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 glory to God. I've come to a time where every prophecy has been fulfilled in Jesus' mighty name. Hallelujah. I want to read to you from Exodus chapter 33, verse 14. I want to ask you that please share the link with your friends. Some people could have, you know, some people are fasting, but they've forgotten, they've gotten so busy. So take a minute right now and help me share the links with your friend. Exodus. Exodus chapter 33. Verse 14. Exodus chapter 33, verse 14. Glory to God. Exodus chapter 33, verse 14. The Bible says this, My presence shall go with thee, and I will give you rest. You are going to pray a very powerful prayer. That Lord, as I go into this year, I thank you because your presence goes with me. Hallelujah. I'm not, I, I'm a child of God. Your presence goes with me. If either you're going for an interview, you're going for a negotiation, the presence of God, the presence of God goes with me. He says, I will, he said, my presence shall go with thee and I will give the rest. You're going to declare that throughout this year, in every phase, in every day of this year, that the presence of the Lord goes with me. It's a declaration in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. I declare that when I go for interviews, when I go for meetings, when I go for proposals, oh, Rabashante Kabaya, that the presence of the Lord goes with me. Declare with me, I will Walk on that and open heaven. Declare with me. I walk on that open heaven. I'm not praying for it. The, when the Bible says my press shall go with you, that means you're walking on that open heaven. Declare, I walk on that open heaven in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. My career is on that open heaven. My finance is on that open heaven. My job is on that open heaven. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, the presence of the Lord goes with me. Masante kabaya, erisonte kaye, elebukupuro masambaliya, ashote kabanina man. I walk on that open heaven in the name of Jesus Christ. My work is on that open heaven. My brand is on that open heaven. My career is on that open heaven. My project is on that open heaven. My life is on that open heaven in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Like Kuparapata Manakarabashandahaya, Eramakoske Bregedi, Ebregete Superevadi, Ebrokotono Robo Sunday, Ebaramanakataya. I'm working on that. An open heaven, mo jekete e kome na suske bregedi le bratama e suske bragadaya. In Jesus' name, we pray. I'm declaring over you that whatever you do in your career, in your work, I declare that you're walking under an open heaven. Your heaven will not be brass. Oh, glory to God! Your heaven will not be short because the presence of the Lord goes with you. You are working under an open heaven. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, concerning your papers, concerning your project, concerning Signing your finances, you are working under an open heaven in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. You are working under an open heaven. I declare the works of your hand is under an open heaven in the name of Jesus Christ. Because you are working under an open heaven, capital will flow to you easily in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Oh, Yapa Yokopaya Kataya. Project will be easy for you to execute in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Oh, Rabakoshe Keteleremana. No project will fail in your hands. No work will fail in your hands because you are working on an open heaven in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Declare with me that I receive it. I receive it. Hallelujah. And the third prayer is something we pray for NLP this morning. This is the last prayer we're going to pray. And it's a simple prayer that every voice of antagonism. Every voice, antagonism means someone just stands against you. Joe doesn't like your God. Every voice of antagonism at work, in the family, in your industry, with your client, every voice of antagonism, let it be silent. Every voice, I don't know, some of you, you need people to speak for you. Every voice of antagonism, right on the interview panel, right in the funding meeting, on your proposal, let every voice of antagonism be silent. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, every voice that is speaking against you, every voice that is 
going against you. Let that voice be silent anywhere you are. Either it mashante kabaya, either it is, either it is on the board, either it is in an immigration office, either it is in the United States, either it is in Baltimore, either it is in Houston, either it is in Manchester, either it is in Toronto, either it is in Zimbabwe, either it is in Canada, wherever you are, either it is in Lagos, either it's in your boss's office, every voice of antagonism that is working against you. I say, let it be silent in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. I pray. Every voice of antagonism in your industry, on social media, on any platform, let that voice be silent in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Every voice that is used to attack you, every voice that is used to resist your progress, Roba, Keisko, Rababa, Entoka, Hebronska, Begaba, let that voice be silent in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Rabush ketein the muri kapani Maria makure masambala. E pruska pa e mene su taliba na 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 e like Panama e mashata. Begin to declare it. Every voice of antagonism this year in my work, in my marriage, in my finance. Let that voice be silent in the name of Jesus Christ. Type it in the chat if you can. Rabba konske brogoduni makare bazaira e riato kaido shai. Na maiko proska, e riato kaito saito paina kuriama, e libruste kamanante. Every voice of antagonism, I said, let it be silence. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, every voice of antagonism, I said, let it be silence. Every voice that is used against you on the interview panel, during your negotiation, during your proposal, during your marriage, during your meeting people, that voice is being silenced right now. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Only the voice of blessing will speak. Rabba kose ponte legebia e ribo shente kide moruate e zuste padamante. In Jesus' name we pray. In Jesus' name we pray. I declare with you today that every voice of antagonism against you is silent. It will not work. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. 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 Every voice of antagonism in any era is silence in Jesus' name. Amen. Once again, I want to thank you for joining the prayers today. Remember this. Remember next, um, what do you call it? Wine press tomorrow and um, next week, Wednesday, Thursday and Friday, 24 to the 26th. Wine press is going to be really powerful. And the next thing is this. If you want to be part of NLP conference in the US, in the UK, or what do you call it in Canada, you can register my bio. If you need one-on-one -on -one praying, all you have to do is to join the NLP community and it will bless you, change your life forever. You just register in the NLP WhatsApp Telegram community. It, it will help you a lot. Thank you for joining today. Have a beautiful day. Remember, every voice of antagonism against you is cancelled and silenced forever in Jesus' mighty name. The person that it's a family member of yours that is used against you to speak against you, that voice has been silenced. The person that the, your, they've been talking bad things to your, vo to your voice about you. That thing is silent in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Thank you. God bless you. Have a good day.